Uh, it's, it's interesting to see the people that have lived in my imagination come into life. Uh, the first time I met Chuck Carrington, the actor that's playing Rennie, and looked at his eyes, I thought, so this is what you look like. Uh, it's been great. And I think the thing that, one of the things I've enjoyed the most is that we have treated this, it's been a collaborative effort. We've both worked hard and spent hundreds of hours on the script and in discussing how the movie's going to be you know, portrayed and the characters and the actors. And uh, it's been a very satisfying experience for me as an, as an author. Um, we've had a rule of thumb that uh, we've made changes to make it cinematic as opposed to novel, but we've also uh, sought things to be creative ourselves, to come up with ideas to make it a little better. And uh, if there's something that I wish I'd put in the novel and we've come up with it to put in the script, then we put it in so it'll show up in the movie. And I hope that people that have enjoyed the novel will you know, see the movie and enjoy some of those changes as well as the, the familiar parts or the favorite parts, the things that they enjoyed when they read the story. It's, uh, it's a little bit unnerving to think that I would be uh, deceived into joining the, the list, but really the men that did this, especially at the beginning, they were well-meaning. They, they were just trying to preserve their way of life in a way that they thought was appropriate. They didn't understand the, the darkness that was at the heart of it, uh, that really comes out later, uh, but seen in the primary uh, portions of the film. I think it's gonna be powerful, and I think it's going to be subtle, yet I think it's gonna emerge in the context of the story uh, and what's portrayed on the film. I believe the spiritual aspects will come to light. Um, I think it'll be real uh, because the spiritual dimension is real and that's what's portrayed in the story or things that could potentially happen in life although it's a fictitious uh, account of a, of a secret society. So I'm, I'm excited about seeing that happen and uh, seeing it come forth.